248 this morning on 8094 near Klein Avenue. Two semis get tangled and crash, one rear-ending the other. The crash closed down the eastbound lanes for more than four hours as rescue crews frantically tried to extricate one of the drivers. The truck was basically um, crushed on top of him. The steering column and the entire dashboard was into his chest and both of his legs were trapped. Crews worked for hours to get the middle-aged driver out with no luck. Meantime, a medical chopper sat in the middle of the roadway waiting for the injured driver to be pulled from the wreckage. The driver of the truck would not have a chance to survive this afternoon if it wasn't for doctors and nurses from here at University of Chicago who arrived via helicopter to the scene within minutes. Tried uh, you know, pretty much everything they could to try to extricate him out. Finally, a source tells NBC5 that doctors had to make the difficult decision to amputate the lower half of one of the driver's legs so they could airlift him to the hospital. If he remained in the cab uh, in the situation that he was in and the condition that he was in, um, his chances of survival would, would have drop precipitously. Dr. Rio Kim and flight nurse Mary Ray cared for the driver at the scene and during the flight to the nearest level one trauma center. Ray calls her colleague Dr. Kim a hero for giving the driver a chance at life after the horrible crash. I, I hope he will be able to pull through. Anthony Ponce, NBC5 News.